Hi and welcome to this new tutorial about mid surface measure. So the topic of today is medial surface extraction in Katia V5. Here is the toolbar mid surface measure and here is our component which is an aircraft component. So first we want to extract the medial surface of the top plate. We can do that with this button medial surface choose the top plate and then to display the result we can use the function height show solid and the result is composed of two things one medial surface and one shell geometry with the right thickness we come back and we will do the same for the bottom plate with no surprise Then we will continue behind here. We take care of displaying the result. And we can see the, the medial surface is too short, but we will use extrapolation very easily to correct this, to make it longer. So this is longer effectively and extrapolation works in all the directions but it is too long so now we will correct this very effectively thanks to medial plane we create a medial plane on the top then a medial plane on the bottom plate and thanks to that planes we will able to cut the long part of this medial surface which is now correctly defined so we keep the extrapolation for this face we display the result and of course it is too long in three directions top bottom and on the right side but very easily we will cut all the parts so we'll choose top and bottom we reuse medial planes and we create a third one directly in the in the in the dialog box and now it's okay so of course we'll do the same over there we can create the medial plane first because we know we will use it so one two and of course we generate the last side with three medial planes now for the cut we can display the results and it's, uh, it's okay it is satisfactory Here we want to make the central part of this tie box. We, cr we choose the central surface. We will increase the extrapolation to cover the three domains. Yeah, as long as this. We'll cut the surface to, to have a clean delimitation. And it's very easy because all the medial planes were already created. And we want to divide now to split the surface where the stiffness are here. So we create first medial planes. And then instead of using limiting surface, we use splitting surface and we choose our two last planes. And look at this, the split is very clean. And now we are ready to continue of our ide idealization of this model. And we will split with this new medial plane. We do that for the mesh later. 
to have common lines, intersections. And we choose the same planes for the cut and then the same for the splitting. And we have our stiffness. So last things to do, the small stiffness. We'll keep, we'll keep a high extrapolation to make the three stiffness aligned in the same time. And we choose all the planes for the cut and also the planes for the splitting, for the split. We continue just below. We choose two stiffeners in one time. So we choose the limiting planes behind and on the side, on the sides, and just in front too. You can notice we, we can choose solid directly. And now this shape thick enough that we have to take into account and we want to cut our medial surface behind with this shape and have um, local properties in it, applied pro local properties in it. We can do that with medial split function. We choose our three edges and find closed paths and the the cut has been done, such as the property has been created, and you can see thick thickness here, which is a local property in fact. Oh, this model is okay. We can hide so solid to see the difference. Everything has been taken into account and this MSM model is satisfactory. You can mesh it now. So we use the common Katia functions to mesh it. We don't forget to constrain some edges. And here too we constrain the on the edges to have the elements and nodes pass on this border. The nodes are automatically captured within a tolerance. So we can continue. We'll mesh behind first. And the same on the other side. We try to work symmetrically. And the last one, which is okay. So we'll check now the free edges. That seems okay. All the nodes are merged. merged. Let's check the intersection. Important too. 
Yeah. And the mesh has taken 2 minutes and 30 seconds. And now let's um, change workbench. Because we want to generate a global image of the sicknesses. Uh, effectively we want to check to control visually if the sicknesses value have been uh, computed uh, properly by MSM. And yeah, it seems okay. With this map color, we can see the thicknesses are different in some, some parts of the model. And yeah, computed thicknesses are satisfactory. This concludes the presentation of mid-surface measure. Thanks for watching.